All right, let's look at this chart we have. You'll notice the first thing right here with Wednesday, it doesn't even have the, it has Wednesday there, but you can't even see it all the way. Well, we have a couple options. We could come up here and simply grab between D and E and drag it to the right to make that column wide. We can make it super wide if we wanted. But if we make it wide like that, it doesn't really look that great, does it? I sort of want all of these B through F, those columns to all be the same. So how can I set it so that all of them are the same width apart? What I have to do is I have to click up here on B, C, D, E, and F. So I right click on those. Now I left click and I go to resize the columns. Now they will start at 100 is the typical size when you open the spreadsheet. We're going to go ahead and say, hey, let's see if 120 will work. And we're changing it that instead of fitting to data, we're going to go ahead and say, hey, make everybody exactly 120 of those columns. That's not bad. We might want to change it to about 130 so that Wednesday looks a little bit better, but we get the idea. Now what we want to do is notice all of these columns are also, you know, and that's a column's huge. I could again grab in between those rows and drag up. And I could try to fix this, but I want them all to be exactly the same. I want all those rows to be exactly the same. So I simply click row two through five. I now left, excuse me, right click in here to say, hey, resize the rows. Let's specify a height. Let's do 30. Okay, and that's not bad. We might want to change it, but it gives you an idea of how you can change and resize your rows and your columns. You simply click and drag them and then right click to resize.